will enter artwork into exhibitions using the Miami-Dade County Public Schools Authentic Assessment Online Submission Platform. The first step in entering the platform is to log in to your account. Type in your username and password and click Login. Once entered into the platform, you will see various links to files essential in submitting your artwork. To submit artwork into an exhibition, click on Enter an Exhibition. You will then be directed to a list of current and upcoming exhibitions. Each exhibition has requirements and guidelines. It also lists the date the exhibition is open for submissions and the last date to submit. Once you find the exhibition you want to enter, click on that exhibition title. This is the exhibition submission form. Here, you will enter your school name and school mail code. The student's first name, last name, grade, and age. For group projects, Enter group in the first name slot and project in the last name slot. Check here if the student has any intellectual disability. Enter the title of the artwork, artwork description slash media, artwork dimensions, and the year the artwork was created. Click choose file to find the artwork you want to enter. Artwork must be in JPEG format and named correctly to be uploaded. The artwork cannot be larger than 3 megabytes in size. For 3D artworks, upload a second image. Leave the collaborating teacher field blank unless you actually worked with another art teacher on the lesson. Enter your school's region and voting district. All this information can be found on the dateschools.net school information directory. Read through the submission terms and check the box to indicate that you agree and click submit. Do not refresh this page. This page shows you the work you have submitted. If you would like to make any changes, click edit. Keep in mind that you must upload the image again to resubmit. If you would like to add another artwork, click Add Another Artwork and repeat the previous steps. If you are an itinerant teacher, you may submit no more than five works from each school unless otherwise specified. Once the deadline for submissions is passed, all artwork undergoes a blind adjudication process. Keep a lookout for a list of accepted entries on the Visual Arts Education Program SharePoint. If your student works are accepted, then the physical artwork must be delivered to the district office. In your physical submission folder, you must include the following information found on the submission site. Find the Inventory tab. The inventory is a list of artworks you've submitted to an exhibition. Print it for your records and put a copy in your submission folder when physically delivering the artwork. Find the Release Forms tab. Click and print the release forms for your students whose artworks were accepted into the exhibition. The release form must be completed by their parent or guardian and returned to you to affix to the back of their artwork before delivering it to the district office. 